Number 26. Assuming that no equilibria other than dissolution are involved, calculate the concentrations of the ions in a saturated solution of each of the following. So see Appendix J for solubility products. And then we have TL, CL. So what I did was I went into that appendix and I found that the solubility product, the KSP, of TLCL is 1.7 times 10 to the negative fourth. So we have to write the balanced equation uh, that breaks down the TLCL into its ions, right? So here we go. TL, TLCL, solid. With KSPs, they always start with a solid. And it will go into its ions. We have TL and Cl. Chlorine, especially when bound with the metal, ionic compound, is always going to be a negative one charge, right, halogens. And then so if there's one to one, right, one Tl for every one Cl, the Tl should be a plus one charge. Aq, Aq, because we have charges, and I'm looking at this compound, it's balanced already, so we're good with that. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to write out our formula for the KSP. Now, the KSP is just equal to the products, right? So KSP equals concentration of TL plus 1 times CL minus 1. And now, let's just try to plug in what we got. Well, we found out from the back of the book that the KSP is 1.7 times 10 to the negative fourth. But I don't know what these concentrations are of the ions. Keep in mind, saturated is just basically means that there's no common ions and it's going to be dissolving strictly from your solid. So I say to myself, okay, I don't know how much is going to dissolve, so I'm just gonna label it as X. But it just has to follow the coefficients. So for TL and CL, I both didn't have a coefficient. That just meant 1, right? So this would be 1x, which is the same as x, and this would be the same as well. These are your values that are going to go into your equation. So TL is going to be x, and CL is going to be x. So 1.7 times 10 to the negative fourth equals, we have x times x, but x times x is just x squared. And now just take the square root. You just want to find out what x is. Solve for x. And maybe I can just bring this up a little bit. And I have x equals, let's see, square root of 1.7 times 10 to the negative fourth. And... I get one, I guess we'll put into scientific notation, 1.3 times 10 to the negative second, and that's molarity. Now they just wanted to know what those concentrations of the ions are. That's what your balanced equation was. So for the TL, the concentration of TL plus one, that was just X, and the concentration of CL minus, that was also just X. And we just found out what X was. So TL was just equal to uh, 1.3 times 10 to the negative second molarity. And the same thing with the CL. 1.3 times 10 to the negative second molarity. And would you look at that? <laughs> that's the answer for this one. Two ions, they were both X's, solve for X, that's it. That's the end of the game. All right. So hang tight because I think there's a couple more letters for this number 26. So if you guys are on the playlist, I highly recommend you are. Um, we could just quickly go into those and we'll get those answered. All right. So I'll see you in a few. If you wouldn't mind pressing the subscribe button in the meantime, that would mean the world to me. Thank you. And I'll see you in a little bit. Bye-bye.